Disturbing allegations about accused sex trafficker Jeffrey Epstein and members of his social circle. Those allegations come from newly unsealed documents from a now settled court case against Epstein associate Ghislaine Maxwell. A woman claims that Maxwell groomed her to be a sex slave to Epstein and was trafficked to some of his most powerful associates. Among those associates, a former senator and a governor. Here's ABC's Lindsay Davis. Tonight, the Jeffrey Epstein scandal is growing. Bombshell accusations point a finger at some rather notable names. 2,000 pages of documents were unsealed in Manhattan federal court related to a defamation case brought by Virginia Roberts Gouffre against Ghislaine Maxwell, an Epstein associate. In court filings, Gouffre says she became an underage teen sex slave for Epstein, who was later directed by Maxwell and Epstein to have sex with many, quote, powerful men, including numerous prominent American politicians, powerful business executives, foreign presidents, and other world leaders. Among those Gouffre names in sworn depositions, British royalty Prince Andrew, former governor and U.N. ambassador Bill Richardson, and the influential former senator from Maine, George Mitchell. All three men have strongly denied the allegations. In statements today, both Mitchell and Richardson say they never met Ms. Gouffre, and these allegations are false. In an interview with the Miami Herald, Gouffre describes how she was trained. The training started immediately. Give Jeffrey what he wants. A lot of this training came from Guilin herself. And being a woman, it kind of surprises you that a woman could actually let stuff like that happen, but not only let it happen, but to groom you into doing it. I was young, I was scared, I knew these people were powerful. I didn't know what would happen if I said no. I didn't know what would happen if they reported, if I reported them. Maxwell has consistently denied the allegations, and in court filings, Maxwell's lawyers wrote that Gouffre had utterly failed to substantiate her patently incredible claims of being trafficked to well-known men. Jeffrey Epstein, charged with conspiracy and sex trafficking, remains under suicide watch in a New York City jail awaiting trial. Lindsay Davis joins us now live in studio. And Lindsay, tonight there is a real possibility other Epstein associates could face criminal charges. That's right, Tom. There's an ongoing investigation into possible accomplices to Epstein's crimes. And there are still thousands of documents in the civil suit that remain under seal. There is an active effort to make those documents public, Tom. All right, Lindsay, thank you for that. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.